Hi, welcome back. And this is part two of the birthday hauls. So went to TJ Maxx mostly, and then a TJ Maxx Home Good combined store, and then um, two Marshalls. But I only found something at one one of the Marshalls. Marshalls be my last resort because our Marshalls don't really be having anything. So um, I'm gonna go over a couple. A few items that's not related to the rest of the haul and then I show you the um what I'm talking about. First I got the Orchid Valley Harvest Omega 3 mix. Um nuts and like fruit little pack it looks like that. And it has and this was on clearance for six dollars and it has walnuts, dried sweet cranberries, almonds, and pistachios. I got two of them. I already opened one. These are great to just grab and go or a little snack. Next, I got some lip balm. And it's from Burke's Bees. And it was pumpkin spice and vanilla bean. It was on clearance for, um, what did it say, $3.50. So, hold on. Next one, I got some face serum from Pacifica, and it has vitamin C and C minerals, SPF protection, broad spectrum. It's still pretty sunny here, and it got an SPF of 55. Um, it's sun, sun care and sun skin care, vitamin C, mineral oils, aloe. UVA, UVB protection, blue light protection, lightweight balance blend, apply evenly and hydrating. And it's uh, cruelty free and vegan. So um, I want to try that one out as well. Next, the rest of this video is body scrubs. So let's get to it. Um, these two are about the same brand and I put the brand right here and the first uh, fragrance is and this is a sugar scrub and it's watermelon I don't have a watermelon sugar scrub and I didn't see too many so I just got this one um, from this company like I said I put the company right here and then the next one I got is the hazelnut hot chocolate and this is a salt scrub i was thinking about doing i like salt scrubs when i do like a pedicure you know or i could use it in the shower too um but this smells so good and it's hazelnut hot chocolate by the same brand um and just make sure when you pick these up that it's still it's still on it because people uh open them a lot in the store and smell them so that's why some of the ones from this brand did smell good to me but they was open and these scrubs i got for well, these are 450 but um the scrub prices range from three dollars to 450 so they was like three dollars 350 and 450. The rest of these scrubs now are by the brand Onyx Bath House. And I got introduced to Onyx Bath House from um, Meet Miss Marie. She has a beautiful collection of them. And I bought two of them. Um, one is in the bathroom now and I love it. So that would make me um, go out and try to find it now. I was like, I just want some body scrubs for my birthday. <laughs> So, um, let's get to it. The first one I did, um, find was the Happy Fall Y'all Farming Body Scrub. And this is what it's looked like. It looks like. And the scent is vanilla and almond. Um, Meet Miss Marie said it smells like almond. I love almond. So I was trying to find this one and I just found it, um at Marshall's <laughs> okay I be up there hating on Marshall's a little bit but it came through a little bit with this one 
So and like I and this one three fifty. Like I said, the price range from three dollars to four fifty that I found them, and mostly the um, ones that was like fallish or Halloweenish was three fifty or three dollars. So can't wait to try that one. I think I pull this one out next to try it since it's like a little fall theme ish. The next two I end up getting was birthday cake. Um, same brand Onyx Bath House, and it's the foaming body scrub. And these was four fifty, so I got two of those. And each one of them um, has like the scent notes on the side, and then. Each one of them have like either a butter or all different oil listed under the title on the label. So this one is vanilla sugar. Uh, it's birthday cake uh, title with vanilla sugar as the fragrance notes. And it's mixed with, it's made with uh, shea butter. So uh, what I learned from Meet Miss Marie was that it slightly changes the texture depending on what um, oil or butter is made with. So, but it's still like a good consistency, like a medium, uh, medium to a little rough. It depends on how much water you add to it. Depend on what uh, the consistency of the body scrub, and then it foam up pretty well as. So this one has shea butter, like I said, and this is birthday cake, vanilla, and sugar. So I got two of those. I finally finally saw these. Um, I didn't see them um, before, unless everybody got them. Next, uh, the Halloween ones that were $3, as you can see. If you can see that, it was $3 and this one was the uh, green apple, well, which please. Let's show you that one first. Which please. And let's see. Uh, and it's green apple, but it's a nice green apple flavor, but it's not for just this time of year, Halloween. So I figured I could use um, this green apple anytime. So it is Onyx Bathhouse. Like I said, these was $3. So I ended up picking up two. Next, I love this one so much. I end up getting three. I was about to get four boxes, and now I get three. I'm going to keep two, and I'm going to give Hubby one to try out. I don't know if he's going to want to try it out. <laughs> but I think he'll like this because it's a little bit more masculine. So that's why I had got three of them. So, and this is none other than Goddess. Forget the packaging, you know, it's a scrub. So, um, Goddess, and it's made with um, apricot oil, and these was four fifty, as you can tell. So I got three of these, and the it got like a little orange, a little cream or tan cream and then it's like a orange and the notes on here are juniper charcoal and musk and it's so good that juniper and that musk it's definitely a more leaning towards more of a masculine fragrance type of um forming body scrub so I got those, let's see, one, two, and then I got a third one. So yeah, I let Helby try it out a little bit, but if he don't like it, I love it. So I love it, if you see three, that means I loved it on Sniff. This one just, if you just like masculine smells or like holiday, this giving me kind of like a holiday vibe with the juniper. So, loved it. I had to pick up 
three, I was like I said, I was gonna get four by that. I don't need that many. You know, I wanna get through my scrubs. But I let Hubby try out a little bit. <laughs> See if he like it, but you know, I don't know. But hey, I loved it. And this is the goddess mixed with apricot oil. Alright. Let's see. The next one I got was the Champagne and Wishes. First time seeing this one when I came into the store that day. And it's Honey and Pear Fragrance. And this is what it looks like. Champagne Wishes. Didn't see this um too much. So I had got two. And it has the note of Honey and pear. Um, this one you definitely smell the uh, pear and the honey. Got a little sweetening. Maybe that's the pear. But um, definitely. And this is Champagne Wishes, and this had Moroccan oil. They have different oils in all of them, and I like that. Um, and this is Moroccan oil in this one, and the fragrance is honey and pear. So, definitely enjoy this one. And these, just be careful with opening them in the store. And just make sure they seal. Because a lot of them I didn't pick up. Sorry, a lot of them I didn't pick up. Sorry about that. Um, I didn't pick up because they was already open. And then I'm glad I had got that before these ladies because she was opening all of them. So, you know. Definitely could smell it. Because they, to me, for the most part, they strong enough to smell through this. You don't have to open it up. And then I think you got, once you open, you got 12 months, I believe. Let me see. Dang. Oh, did I see that on these? I'm not sure. Let me see. Yeah, you got 12 months out there open. So just make sure they, they seal when you get them. Next, I picked up a hot mess. And I was debating. I wasn't going to pick this up at first. Um, Cause I didn't know if I liked it or not. But this is hot mess made with pomegranate uh, oil. And these was 450. So that would that look like with the pomegranate oil. And it looks like a pink, a yellow, and then a pink, which is cute. And the fragrance notes are plum granny, musk, and honey. So it's it, it's different. Um, you get the honey and plum granny. It's musky. It's like a little tart. So. Got those two. This is my first time seeing this one. I didn't see it at different stores. So I just saw it at one store. Like this one, I saw this one at one store. So the Goddess and the Hot Mess Express Hot Mess uh, Plum Granite Must Honey Plum Granite Oil. So I still want to try it out. And one of them is definitely a little darker than the other one, but. That's cool. Um, let's see. Next one I got was the uh, Mermaid Off Duty, and it's the Foamy Body Scrub uh, made with jojoba oil. And the notes are, Frank's notes are coconut and lime. This is very like a coconutty, citrus type vibe. And they had another one that was coconut. Um, I'm not a big fan of coconut, so I got two, but I'm gonna let Hubby try one. You know, cause he like coconut oil. I'm like, it's a scrub, honey. Like, don't care about the packaging. It's cute, but you in your house and you using the scrub, so it don't matter what it look like. So he like coconut, so I got two. I was gonna get one of these. But, um, like the coconuts taste, smell like coconut oil really to me. 
Um, but you know, coconut probably good for your skin. Well, it got jojoba oil, so mm, this is my least favorite out the bunch, but it's still cool. I still use it. Um, it just smell like coconut or coconut really to me. So they had another one that was coconut and it was in the Halloween package. But for some reason, I think it was some creepy, keep creeping it real or something. But that one on set wasn't on sale. Um, and it was a Halloween packaging. So that was weird. So I just got this one because they was on sale and it was coconut. So it was, uh, coconut is all right to me. Um, next. I got these, well, these two, but it's different packages. It has a fall packaging, and this is Look on the Bright Cider Life, and it's um, made with cranberry oil, and the fragrance note is cranberry, and this is the fall version, and this one, oh, it's different. I didn't realize there were different oils in it. So let me put this separately. So I only got one of these. Um, the other two was open. And it looked like somebody dug in one of them. So I just got one because I would have got two of these. So this one, like I said, is cranberry. And it's made with cranberry oil. I thought both of them had cranberry oil in it. But they don't. So yeah. This is the fall uh, version, I guess. Of that one. And this is the Halloween version. And it say cranberry, but I now see that the oil is jojoba oil. So both of them say cranberry. Like these two say cranberry, but this one has cranberry oil in it. And this one, um, the grout, the Gold's Night. Gold's Night? Um, Ghoul's Night. And this one just has jojoba oil. So... It depends, but both of them smell like cranberry to me. <laughs> and this one has the purple and the like burgundy at the bottom. So, but these both smell like cranberry to me. This one just more a little bit more um fruity. A little bit more fruity on the notes versus this one. Uh, not as fruity, but just a little. Like to me, this is brighter than this one, but I take them both. All right, so next I got the Always Be Unique Unicorn Dreams, Unicorn Dreams with um, Moroccan oil. So it looks like that with the pink, yellow, and blue. And the sit notes on here are Strawberry, kiwi, and apple. Very fruity, sweet. So, finally, finally saw this one. I haven't even seen it in stores, but one store. Um, so, I just picked up two. I think it was the last two, so it must be a popular one. Next one, I love this one because it's more peach. It has a more peachy note. And this is the Beach Vacay with coconut oil. And this one, it don't smell like coconut oil to me. It definitely smells like the fragrant notes, which are peach and raspberry. More so of the peach right now on, you know, regular snails versus in the shower. But that's why I loved it. And I picked up two because I love the peachness of it. And it has purple and blue. Uh, notes on it right i mean the color differentiations on it 
So I like that one. One of my other favorites. Um, and I saw it at one store and they had three. So I just grabbed three because they smell so good. And this one is the, let me see. I hate when they put all the labels on the front so you can hardly read it. So it's sweet like honey with honey extract. So I got one, two, three. Because this one smells so amazing. And the notes on here are fragrance notes of honey and lavender. And this one's made with honey extract. Smell like fresh laundry. Mmm. Hey, you can smell that lavender. It just smells so fresh and clean. Mmm. If you like lavender, this is the one, but it's a nice lavender. Um, and it has like a pale pink and then purple. And you can see it on here as well. Pale pink and then the purple. But yeah, this is Sweet Like Honey with Honey Extract. So I got three of those. So my top favorite of this bundle is the Sweet Like Honey and the Goddess. Love, these are my top, top favorite of this one. And then if I had to choose a third one, it would be the Beachy Vacay. Even though it got coconut, it smells like peaches to me. So these are my top three from this one. Yeah. <laughs> so that is it. That is all. Um, so yeah, that is it. Um, I had fun looking for these and I was surprised that, um, I found them because it wasn't like this is a popular brand, the Onyx, especially the Onyx um bathhouse brand is really popular, so or most of them sometimes be open, so it's hard to um catch them really, but when you catch them, grab them. And I was just looked up in two stores that had most of them, like a TJ Maxx really do have them. Um Marshalls have like a few, but and then most people open them. So hey, it is what it is. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.